on me. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> I, I love it. I don't know. I got it's... hooked on it. You you I know will, what seltzer water will I help will you do? Thank you for it, but I don't know if it's. You know what? Thanks, Chris. Fuck it. Seltzer water will help you drink less. Seltzer water will help you travel. Quite honestly, you know what I do when I travel? Sometimes I just drink seltzer water. You know what I do um, when I travel? I get a full seltzer water, open it, and forget it to my car while I'm driving until I get there. Yeah, and then you have it for later, though. Um, yeah. Okay, welcome back. Welcome back. Uh, some seltzer <laughs> water rant. Um, Chris, go ahead. Who are we making? Uh, we are making the uh, the operator. So, background story. So, we um, are going to a large city. It's our first. It's not our first, but it's going to be our essentially our first well-run. It's the biggest massive city. city. It's a trade city. It's huge. So, we were just talking about traveling, and I was telling Chris, we should make a travel. Like, how should we travel? And he said... Um, something along the lines of, you know what would be cool is if they went to a payphone and they picked up and it said something like Hello Operator, a.k.a. Uh, the Matrix. And what an amazing idea. Now, it's going to be up to me to decide whether or not that's exactly a payphone. It might be something different, but it, it'll, be, it'll be hilarious. Where it is. Um, mm -hmm. But when you pick up the phone, you have a chance of traveling to wherever you want to go on a bad roll you'll go whatever i'll make a table you, you'll seven, have a mishap or something right like all of a sudden you're yeah. in, uh king lololo's uh chambers yeah, personal bed chambers yeah I, every every roll of 20 in triguard is you <laughs> run into it's king, king lololo's Lolo. <laughs> bathroom <laughs> Yeah, and he's and he's <laughs> occupying the toilets, you know that type of that type of thing. <laughs> How did you get in here? You know. Um, okay, so the operator is going to be, um, from a player standpoint, you're not. The way I'm going to play it is, you're going to pick up the phone and say, "Well, before I don't want it to be hello operator like the Matrix. Yeah, it's going to be yeah. something else." I say we build the character, then the last role is going to be hello, you know. So we, mm -hmm. I, I, I uploaded I like um, eight, there are, I looked up eight, synonyms for operators, and okay. there are eight of them. So you'll roll, Good. you Perfect. will roll a 1d8 to determine that um, at, the, at end. the end. Yeah. Okay. Names, Chris, I'm ready. And I'm going to use my daughter's. Uh, she finally she got this for me for. So the, the name, the true Christmas name letters. of the, of the uh, personality the behind the operator. Yeah. <clears throat> Is it going to be? So here's a question, a, a DM question. Mm -hmm. I'm actually answering. We're we're going to make this a robot cop style. So it was a real person that got turned into. Oh, when they when they when they show up, it's it. There's just a phone there. Yeah, but it's there's like a the ear of 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 some scientist was originally used, and his whole personality is in there because it was the original person was melted with the technology. It, there's there's travel. photos of there's photos of travel. <laughs> uh, listen, have guys, you seen this? Go back to have you seen this? 50. No. Listen, go back to session fifty one on YouTube and and check out travel. Um, so the question, if what's the uh, what's the the species, the race of whoever the scientist would have been? Well, I think it should be would have been of, what? But it's Trigard gnomes. Trigard is is dwarf gnomes, primarily dwarf and gnomes. Primarily dwarf. Um, let's do dwarf. Yeah, let's do dwarf. Dwarf. Okay. Under... Oh, well, there's not to be. Roll me a d twenty. 
Happily, here we go. Great. Even male, odd female names. Uh, that's an eight. So, okay. Roll me a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So roll me a D10. For the first name. Five. Five. One, two. Okay. Herdret. What is it? H-E-R-D-R-E-T. Herdret? Herdret. Yeah, that's not bad. Herdret. Okay. And uh, the last name, I'll roll my D10. Nice. A one for the last name, Copper Belly. Oh, I like that, Copper Belly. Perfect. Shameless plug, that was, they use fantasy name generators.com. Yeah. <laughs> um, Herdrit Copper Belly. I'm going to write in quotations operator, but I will be ready to erase that. I cannot wait to see. <laughs> okay. Herdrit uh, Copper Belly. So, this guy, for some reason, is in charge of the most advanced, easiest way to tra uh, oh, or not. It doesn't have to be the easiest. Mm -hmm. uh, it could be the yeah. weirdest way of uh, transportation because you're in a big city. There are a lot uh, going back to the transportation or traveling uh, conversation. There are going to be a lot of interactions in the city. Doesn't necessarily mm -hmm. mean that there's going to be. Uh, kidnappers or robbers or, you know, uh, hangings or whatever it is that you have in cities. Um, it could be, you know, there are going to be a lot of things that you perceive. So there's going to be a lot of, there's going to have to be a lot of descriptions. You're in a city. It is mm -hmm. the most, you know, elaborate, technologically advanced city. So, you know, one encounter table I could make is going to be just looking and seeing something, and maybe you guys see there's, there's a blimp in the sky, mm -hmm. or you see it, whatever. Um, so this guy, Herdrick Copper, Copper Belly, um, is going to be an operator. He is going to be, some for some reason, employed or owner of uh, TBD. It might, we might discover mm -hmm. that in a couple of roles. Yeah. Uh, the transportation uh, of the weird transportation via phone booth. Let's just say, let's say phone booth. Yeah. Might have to have another uh, table of synonyms for phone. Yeah. You're going to, yeah. Here I'll, uh, All right. Yeah. Go ahead. So, do we want to do stats or random? Other ideas about them first. <laughs> Let, let's do uh, the other things. Call Go. box. That's hilarious. Call box. Yeah. Let, let's just. We're gonna roll on that. That's good. Yeah. Um. So it's uh. Which which table we want to do the uh, description big, and big city dens. Uh, oh yeah. Um, yeah. Go to page uh, ninety nine of your the game master's book of non player characters, Jeff. Uh, Ashworth, mm -hmm. amongst others. Um, pretty good. Okay. How about you roll the description? I will roll a description. Oh, which page are we doing? We're going to do the one on 99. Well, yeah. Let's just do Ready? that and that works. Oh, oops. Uh, oh, hey, that's 20. Nice. <laughs> too perfect you gotta read too his first perfect. Name. you gotta read the first name the, the first name yeah go ahead no we already, we already have his name oh uh, yeah no no i mean perjured copper the, the, belly. The, 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 copper belly with a missing left ear and a drooping bottom lip it's the dice tell the story. It's too perfect. That's a left. It says left eye. He's got a missing left eye. So he's got a patch. Oh, left eye. Yeah, he's left got a patch. eye. Don't worry. I I can't. Have I read that as ear. Listen, the best of us uh, have uh, 
dyslexia and stuff. I'm not worried about it. I think I secretly wanted it to be a left ear. I know. You know why you said left ear? Because I was talking about uh, Mike Tyson's ear, ear edibles. The ear. He's probably. It. Mike Tyson, um, you should play with us, Mike. Waiting for you. I made a character about you. Um, wants and needs 11. Wants and needs. Here, you know what? I'm going to go to the, the other page. I like to go back and forth. So, oh. wants and needs. I rolled an 11. Who could... <laughs> Uh, Herdrick Copperbelly with a missing left eye and drooping bottom lip who could really use a stiff drink. <laughs> I think we're fine. Understanding his true motivation. Yeah. Does, he wants to get across the city and get a drink, but he doesn't want anyone to see him. Or he has a hard time navigating the busy city with one eye. That's so funny. doesn't have his death perception. Um, all right, his secret or obstacle. That's you roll. Yeah. Uh, that's a three. On third page for this one. Yeah, whatever you want. And always forgets something. <laughs> this guy sucks. This guy's great. <laughs> Yeah, you know, I mean, I, that's what I mean. Yeah, you know? yeah. All right. <laughs> what, what is what does he got he's on got, him? He's got a missing eye. He's got a drooping lip. He really wants to drink. Like he has been working a nine to five for like fucking ever, and he always forgets something. <laughs> and he this has. I can relate to this guy so. Oh my god. This is like my, he, This guy is me on a daily. Uh, so three. <laughs> Let me go back to this one. Uh, also carrying a three. Uh, three copper, three um, silver, and a large a large conch shell attached to a wooden spoon. So he's got some. I'm just gonna write money. Uh, I'm gonna figure out what the uh, the triguard currency is. Uh, mm -hmm. and i will elaborate on that that's gonna be fun uh but he that's carries good. around he carries around a large shell attached to a wooden spoon so that could be a cool if you guys meet him i'm not going to I will plan a little bit about the spoon in the shell. If you guys I, ask about it, I will let you know the lore drop there. But there, <laughs> there, it will be massive. It will be very enlightening. So mm -hmm. um, this guy is operating like the operator. He needs a stiff drink he, <laughs> in the Matrix. Let's go. Um no, he it's, he's not working the nine to five. He's working an eighteen hour day. Yeah, because he doesn't work at night, and he's the only operator that there is. It's, yeah, he's the only guy. He's the only guy. Okay, so I'm gonna roll. I'm gonna roll a six, and this is for um, what it's the called the telephone booth. Like, where do they go to the telephone yeah. booth? But I don't want to mm -hmm. use telephone booth because that's not you know. Yeah. So here we go. I got one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. One. It's a call box. It's a call nice. box. Hey! The call box. The call box. The other cool one would have been coin telephone or uh, a, pay sta a pay station. But call box is great. Call box is perfect. <laughs> call box. <laughs> no. And who is it? I'm going to say that there's a random box on the street that looks like you could pick it up and answer it. I don't even know how to describe that. Um, I don't want it to be a telephone looking thing. I want you guys to go up to it and be like, is this... Whoa! You know? Okay. This is well, the no, most it, important. It, yeah, no, go it go old something. school. It has to have a receiver. Oh. It doesn't have to have the receiver. It could have old school. It could have like the little stand. The stand mic and the little your old earpiece that oh, you put to your yeah. ear. yeah. The radio thing or whatever. Mm -hmm. All right. The, no, the old is, phones. This is this very is, 
important. This is a very important thing because I feel like the call box is going to be used a lot. Um, yeah. All right. Synonyms for operator. Uh, Who are we call are, There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are nine mm. here. A D10 uh, oh, no, 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 and re roll tens. Hold on. One, two, three, four. Five. Let me just make sure this are all. No, this is a different op oh. operator in sense of worker or just here. Here's one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah. No, here's we'll roll one D eight. It's just eight. D eight. Okay. Yeah. Here we go, baby. A five. A five. So one, two, three, four, five. Mechanic. Mechanic. That's perfect. That's perfect. <laughs> He's the mechanic. Mechanic, the call. I box need to get mechanic. to the call box mechanic. Mechanic. Oh my god. Yeah, that's okay. great. So you want to know a great um, game hook? You guys are gonna find a piece of paper at some bar or at some hotel that we were talking about. Mm -hmm. We were talking about having a hotel where it's like the inn and the hotel were split. There's a bar and it's part inn, part bar. And there's, uh, you guys are going to find something and it's going to say the mechanic isn't what he seems or something like that. Wow, Here, here's, here's, uh, here's your, we, you see a, like a bulletin board inside of a tavern or some bar and you see an advertisement for the call box and someone has scribbled on it. And uh, red paint or something, or red wax. The mechanic is not who he seems. Yeah. Or something like or that. There you the go. The mechanic must die. Um, Death right, to the so... mechanic. <laughs> I might just start playing. This, the mechanic might be the best character ever. All right. St uh, strength, the dex. 46. Let's go. Um, intelligence, wisdom, intelligence, charisma. Wisdom. I need to get another set of that. Hold on a second. Mm -hmm. Love this guy. Absolutely love him. We, we um, have we have made so many characters for Triguard. It's so good. It's so good. <laughs> I have we're to gonna go. be I have here to... for twenty. We're gonna be here for twenty sessions. I'm just giving you a heads I, up. I, I'm gonna need your help putting it on D and D Beyond. And I just realized that we can post uh, D and D Beyond links for the characters on our for, uh, for like for any the so, shareable. So you can, the sh yeah, you can. We can create Lolololo, and we can put him mm. on a post in yeah. And have uh, the shareable so, link so yeah, people can see yeah. them. Let's do that. Mm -hmm. All right, you roll okay. for roll for strength. Strength. Okay. The operator. As always, forty six dropped the lowest. Not bad. Thirteen. Okay. He has to haul all these call boxes around. Is he dexterous? Wow, that's a sixteen. This guy's looking like the little uh, put well, him. Uh, he is in the he here. is the mechanic. They don't call him the mechanic for nothing. That's right. He's strong I mean, and agile. More agile. He's athletic. He's ripped. He's ripped. He's ripped. Does he have heart though? Her, uh, Herbert, I, Herbert, Herbert Copperbelly. I feel like Constitution is like. Does he have soul? You know. <laughs> What's that? Math, that's an 11. Wow, that's pretty good too. Wow, we might be on tonight. Is he no. smart? Is the, Are they angry at him in Trigard because he can't get anyone anywhere? <laughs> These next two roles, intelligence and wisdom, particularly, uh, I guess both of them, are going to be very telling of the system. Wow, okay, this is... That is a five, eight, nine. Nine. 
I rolled okay. two ones, a three, and a five. <laughs> nice. Yeah, so nice. not 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 the 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 smartest. In charge of the most. That, yeah, it's good. That that, but that's why he's a mechanic, and he just well he sits yeah. on the line working. He works eighteen hours because he's not the brightest. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, that's that's why when you pick the when you operate the call box uh, and the mechanic picks up, he, he might not pick up. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> or you, it'll be a hard roll then to get you where you want to go. Yeah, more failures. Yeah. But you have to describe it. It's, oh, very specifically where you want to go. But he is decently wise. Three, four, five, uh, it's 12. Oh, he's wise. So he. So intelligence is saying that he, the apple, main things is he's the very apple is edible. The the intelligence is saying that the apple is edible, right? And wisdom would say that the apple tastes. Really? How is how is the how is the the difference between intelligence and wisdom? It's like I I forget can, the good saying. Or no, you can eat the apple. Intelligence says where the apple came from, maybe. All right, charisma. Um, charisma. That was a tangent. Charisma to you. For for anyone who's watching, that was my tangent. Enjoy the apple. Uh, charisma. Is he? I hope he's fucking knockout here. That'd be sick. Nope, not at all. <laughs> That's fucking perfect. <laughs> Um, that is that's that exactly is, how I pictured him. That is a nine. Yeah, it's not bad. So he's gonna you know what? He's gonna be a male version. He's gonna be a dwarf male version of the operator from Ghostbusters. Hey, call box, what do you want? Uh um, perfect. And but he's gonna be dumb. And yeah, very dexterous. Well, he, he's not going to... Well, here's how you play stupidity. He doesn't understand the place. He doesn't remember the places that the people are... Oh, you, you want to go to the... Um, where is that again? Yeah, <laughs> he forgets. I'm sorry, but we He doesn't know where anyone is. Who is this, Melrin? That'd be hilarious. Um... <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen, things... You guys went back in time. Things changed. Melrin might be alive. Yeah. Pleskin might be alive. Yeah. Yep. Rena yeah. might be alive. Nice. No, Rena's dead. He's definitely dead. We already beat that, that story to death. Um, but here's here's something I just thought of. Um, <laughs> With acid. What, <laughs> what uh, okay, so he's the mechanic, operator, call box. Um, is he I think he's hired by the king right I think he's I think this is not something. directly or or you could have it this is um, a, think, a, a side experiment project or like some small business that's trying to get going I think I think he's employed by the city and I think that the taxpayers have to pay for his for his uh, operation skills. And I think the people in the city don't necessarily like the fact that the, the minute you know, I got a business that, that, that they're paying for it. Yeah. And, and the guy is an idiot. And yeah, but then, but then I don't, I don't, you know, people in our group might not want to use the call box, but that's up for them to figure out. Well, he could, he could be uh, related to some governmental, some official or, Lo, 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 maybe lo. he's Lolo's like stupid, like a younger. Maybe he's his Lolo's cousin who's not very bright and you can't really trust him with stuff. So they put him in charge of this thing. Yeah, and and uh, people don't like him because he's because of nepotism. Yeah, like he, he didn't deserve it. Why does he get this? Or wow. wait, what? Dangerous. What is what is his wife again? Is Lolo's Lolo's wife a dwarf? Lolo's wife is a no. A no. No. She's not known. She's having known babies. She's definitely having known babies. Because it could be 
her brother. Where is she? <laughs> That's always the the better, the funnier uh, connection. It could be her. I think I like that. Uh, what's her name? Her, it's her brother. I, yeah, forget, I forget the queen's, queen's name. brother. Yeah, queen's brother. Oh, and that's why that's why the assassins uh, can travel around the city so well because they take advantage yep. of it because he forgets it. That's perfect. Mm -hmm. Nice. There you go. Uh, Herdrit Copper Belly with a missing left AKA eye. AKA the mechanic. Yeah, the mechanic with a missing left eye and drooping bottom lip. Sounds like a lot of people I know on a daily basis who can really use a stiff drink and always forgets something. Who carries a shell and wooden spoon is the operator or the mechanic. The mechanic at the call box. Here, here's a solution to your uh, shell and wooden spoon. He forgot why he carries it around. Yeah, I don't know why, I'm but he always it, has it. I think I've I, always done it, and I'm just going to keep doing it. Yeah. <laughs> That's hilarious. So there you go. There's there's a perfect solution for your travel problems. Just roll mm -hmm. yourself an operator from the Matrix and you know, see what happens. Um, I feel like you know what we're going to do. I'm going to have I'm have to create some sort of me mechanic for rolling and you guys are all going to roll and I'm going to use one of your things that you talked about in the, in the in the uh mm -hmm. previous um travel uh podcast and I'm going to have you all roll and average it out and that's how we'll that's how we'll proceed instead of having one I mean, player pick it up and go right? or you can have each person like the matrix each split person the has to do it themselves time. splitting no. the group during traveling is dangerous that yes. will bog everyone down Unless yes. they all go to a different room at that hotel or, bar. Or we all roll and you roll and those are the complications. And if you guys all roll below a five or the majority roll below a five, you all go back mm -hmm. to the hotel bar. Because <laughs> <laughs> he wants to go get a stiff drink. I don't know. <laughs> I like it. Yeah. All right, if cool. he built in his back door <laughs> yeah. I really do like the idea though and I'm definitely going to steal it I, I don't know if you guys are ever going to go go there I'm sure as soon as I introduce the character Matt's going to want to kill him um, or at least find out where the where the call box is um, and you guys get there and it's just the call box there's no person that's fucking awesome <laughs> I love it Yeah. alright till next time Awesome. Stay sexy, my friends. <laughs>